Hi guys. <laughs> so this is an odd <laughs> filming situation. Okay, but I'm gonna be making um, like homemade ramen, and I'm gonna be using the Indomie Magori noodles, and um, um, I'm gonna be putting carrots, a uh, like green onion, and this is regular onion garlic carrots and then <clears throat> after it's done the seasoning I'll put in a little bit of garlic a little bit of black pepper a little bit of onion powder and a little bit of cayenne and the seasonings that I'm using I'm using one of each is a low sodium uh, it's a bou bouillon cube, so it's a low sodium one. It's veggie, and then this one's a, a beef, and these are, um, they are vegan. They have the W on the side right there. I hope you guys can see. It looks like from here that it's like a really good, you know, so, but <clears throat> we're going to need three cups, and I have my measuring cup right here, and it's two cups. So I'm going to fill it up. And that was two. I'm doing a little extra. Okay. And then I just put these little cubes in there. And they come like this. Just like that. And just plop them in there. Like that. And then we put the other cube in there. Like that. And then you kind of poke them a little bit. Um. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that. You just poke them a little bit so that they're like, so they break up a little bit so they're not one huge hard piece. And then. Um. Maybe I'll put a little more water in there. I put an extra half cup. Because sometimes I get nervous and I'm like, oh no, there's not going to be like enough, um, like enough water or whatever. So, and then you have your, this thing looks weird. It's a garlic smasher. So, and you need your knife. And you put the garlic in there like that. And then you go and you crush it. And then you go like that. And see how the garlic the garlic comes out. And everybody and like the garlic like it comes out through there too. Like on the inside and everything. So you want to get that. I like garlic and plus everybody at my work has been sick. So and I started feeling a little sick this morning, actually yesterday, so, like, and then this, like, today I had a little bit of, like, the, um, the chills, then you get the other garlic and you just put it in there, and you go, like that, scrape it, and then, there's, like, little bits that go right there, like that, and you scrape it, and you go like that. And with that, you want to make sure that you do put that little uh, garlic presser or whatever into water because if you don't, the little pieces of garlic that are left on there are going to dry and it's really gross. 
and we have onion right here just like chopped up like plain onion put that in there and the carrots the carrots and the green onion are for oh, my carrot tastes kind of weird but ooh, it tastes kind of funky uh, I'll still eat it the green onion and the carrots are for garnish and I think that's it just stir that around get the onion it looks funky right now but I promise you it's gonna taste really good Did you guys see it you know the glare is on there but it's gonna be really really good so And then, you just take your pot, and you just put it on there and let it boil. Um, you let it boil for probably, I don't know, um, like maybe 20, 30, like 15, 20 minutes, let it boil. And you stir it and stuff like that. So it's going to take a little while for it to um, like start boiling. And you can put the lid on there. Just like that. And it will make it cook faster. And then you do want to... Um, and you do want to get a pot for boiling the ramen well see that's the thing I don't know I don't know if I want to put the ramen like put the ramen in here or use this and dip the broth over the ramen I think that's what I'll do but so you just let it boil and it should like it should take a minute or two for it to go and for all that stuff to dissolve and stuff like that. And if you want to do more flavor, um, like, because the blue, the blue on cubes or whatever they're called, they're a little, they're a little salty. But if you just want to add a little more, um, like, flavor, just put, that was like a teaspoon. Just put that in there. And it gives it like a brown color. smells like water for right now so it should be good you just stand here and stir it or just let it be and then come back to it whichever and we'll be back
We're going to turn it off and then we're going to bring it over here, which I think you can see, hopefully. And then I could pour the whole thing in there, but I'm going to do it like this. Sounds like someone peeing. Let's see. Go like that. <gasps> look at those noodles. They look so good. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Don't they look so good? Put your noodles in there. My mouth is like watering. I'm like... Put it in there. Yummer. And then you put this off to the side. I made such a huge mess right now. Stir this a little bit. Then you put your broth in. And a lot of people I've seen... Um, they cook their meat in the broth. Like the broth is like super, super hot. I'm gonna get all the noodles. All the noodle. Ow. Ah. That was hot, Jessica. There. Okay. And then you can save that for later for broth when, like, Stay in the middle of the night, you get hungry, and you're like, oh yes, I forgot about the broth. Let me make two more noodle ramen packets. So we have that in there. And I'm going to put some garlic. Let's put a little garlic like that. And then a little bit of pepper. A little bit of onion. Oh, it smells good. And then a little bit of the cayenne. And okay. And then I don't know if I'm gonna use these onions. They taste kind of funky. That'll be fine. I don't think I'll die. I won't use all of them though. And then I love green onion. Mm. And you have green onion. And then you do want to put this because it's going to be hot on the bottom. You want to put it onto a little hot little plate thing. And there's your ramen. So let's go eat. <gasps> mm, that's the garlic. Oh, I'm so excited. Mm. Okay, so I'll give I'll see you guys at the table. Bye. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I just finished cooking this, as you guys saw. So it's time to taste it. Um I did not taste it during I didn't taste it during the whole entire production, so I have no clue. Let's see. And it has, it's just ramen with homemade broth. It smells good. It smells very onion y because I did put a lot of onions in it. Let's try it. Ooh. It's like really steaming. I feel like my face is getting like a steam facial. It's gonna smell like onions afterwards. That is good. I 
feel like I feel like I've been like in I've been in love with this ramen this ramen is really good <laughs> oh my goodness I'm gonna take another bite of noodles and I'm gonna try the broth because I can taste the broth kind of on the noodles a little bit Those are good. Let's try the broth. Let's get some carrot and and I put a little bit of um what do you call that? Um olive oil in it. Just like the tiniest little amount because I was talking to a coworker today, Val, and he was like it has a little bit of oil in it. And I was like, okay, pal, I'll we'll put some oil in it. Mmm. Mm. Ooh, that's good. That little bit of soy sauce that I put in there. Perfect. So good. Imagine if I went to a Chinese restaurant and I was like, give me chopsticks. <laughs> I can't even get the noodles on there. Because they're wet. That's why. Come on. Okay. I can't get them. I think it's because these are glazed or something. Oops. I think because these are glazed, like... And this one is square, and that one is round. That is why I... Th mm -hmm. I should take these back to bed, to um, World Market and be all like, Why did you give this to me? Or why didn't I look before I bought it? They'd probably say that. <laughs> be like, it's your fault. But... It's actually pretty good. I like... And I like to get, like, onion on here. Ooh, that was garlic that I tasted, I think, earlier. Mmm, that's really good. That's really good. <clears throat> so, apparently on the news today, I mean, the only news today is about Kim Kardashian getting held up at gunpoint. I don't know, some places say she wasn't harmed, and then other places are saying, she was bound and gagged and tied up and this and that and da 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 and like pistol whipped and blah blah blah. And then other places are like, she was just held at gunpoint and her stuff was taken and she was fine. Come on people, what's the news? What's the news? But, oh, the green onion tastes so good. Oh my goodness. And the half raw, uh, the half raw onion is so good. It's so delicious. <gasps> Seriously though, oh my goodness. And I'm kind of a fiend when it comes to ramen. Like, I sit here and I'm like, <laughs> like, <laughs> really like eating it. <laughs> Not like my other ones where I'm like, oh, I'm just going to take, well, no, I guess I don't take little bites of the other ones either. Mm. Oh, well. It's good. Oh, and the Indomie 
like the noodles the noodles are really good I can't get over like how good the noodles are they're so good I was going to put mushrooms in this and then like I was picking up the mushrooms because they were already sliced so I'm like standing there and I'm looking at them and everything and I'm like picking them up like with my hands or whatever and I'm like these are kind of slimy they were all slimy, all the mushrooms. I was like, this is so gross. I'm not going to eat these. I think they were bad. I don't know. Someone probably, like, had them and then, like, took them out and, like, set them on the on a table or something or, like, in the store, like, on a shelf or something and just left them there, not in, like, the cooler fridge area or whatever. Marry me. It's so good. Like seriously, it's just really good. Has a little bit of taste of a mushroom. Even though there's no mushroom. So good. <clears throat> Sorry if you're offended by me putting my bowl to my mouth. How am I supposed to drink? I mean, I'm all like, how am I supposed to drink the <laughs> the soup? I don't have a utensil. <laughs> but something yesterday oh I saw this little thing on my Facebook this little little uh, dog he was like the tiniest little dog who like the guy had him like this in his hand and the dog like fit perfectly into his hand or he might have had him like this I don't know but I, I think it was like one hand but the little dog fit into his one little hand and I guess the dog just got groomed or something. And he looked like a little tiny fluffy teddy bear. He was so cute. He was like the tiniest little thing. And he was all calm too. Because usually dogs, usually puppies are like all crazy and wild and everything. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's even better down at the bottom. <sighs> oh. Seriously though. <clears throat> like when the noodles kind of sit in the... Okay, these noodles, like... Okay. Let's do anatomy of the noodle. Okay, these are squishy okay it's an indomie noodle if you didn't know had like i haven't said it like 10 times but these this noodle it's not it's squishy but it's not squishy squishy like it's been sitting down at the bottom but it's not like if you use the like top ramen it gets so big and it's like really gross and disgusting it looks like it tastes like um what do you call that um like wet bread but these don't taste like that <gasps> that's a big piece of garlic oh my goodness I'm sweating. <clears throat> I'm sweating profusely. But it feels so good. Oh my goodness. Like, my upper lip is sweating quite bad right now. My nose is running a little bit too. But it tastes so good.
carrots don't taste bad either. I really wanted mushrooms in this. I could have used canned mushrooms, but... Squishy, squishy. This is broth at the end. It's really good. <coughs> I took cayenne pepper. I tasted it. Tastes good though. This bowl is like as big as my head. But I would not have gotten a different bowl. I'm like sweating on the side of my face. <laughs> oh my goodness. I should have had the camera like <clears throat> really close on my face. <laughs> I felt it. It's all like, <laughs> like going down the side of my face. Plus I didn't feel good. So I'm trying to sweat it out also. Sorry. Like I am trying to sweat it out. So. How's your guys' day been? What have you guys been up to? What have you guys been? What do you guys eat? Like, for dinner, or for lunch, or like, what do you take to work to eat? I don't take, I eat lunch at home because I don't take, I don't have like, I don't eat at work. Well, that's a lie. So, <laughs> sometimes I do eat at work, but I um, like if I'm like really like if I didn't eat like like this right here is probably all I'm going to have today because I don't want to overload myself with well, not that I overload myself all the time, but I've been eating like a lot of junk food really bad. But like and when I say junk food, I'm talking like like bakers, like burritos and stuff like that. And like, um, I did have meat, which I'm not proud to say that, but, <clears throat> oh, that felt so good. I am so sorry. <clears throat> that was like building up <laughs> and I was trying to like let it out, like all like, like beep, beep. It, like all slow have you guys seen that commercial okay there's this commercial that I was watching um, I was watching some guy's channel and um, the commercial because they do ads and stuff and the commercial that came up I was sitting there and I was watching I wasn't really paying attention and then I heard like I heard that and so I was sitting there and I was watching it and I was like what the heck what kind of commercial is this and then I look and I'm like oh it's for that spray, the poopery spray. And like, <laughs> this commercial is so crazy. So this girl, okay, uh, it'd be like having a dining room like this and the table. And like, imagine if you're like, imagine you're at your, your partner, your lover, your husband, your wife, whatever you may be to the significant other, or even dating. And you ate something that was kind of funky, it made your stomach kind of funky, you know, and like you had to go to this dinner and you're sitting there and your stomach's like, and you're like, Ooh, okay. You're like, okay, whatever. And then like two seconds later, your stomach's like, <laughs> you're just like, Oh my goodness. Okay. And you're like, and they're 
like, you're like, oh, excuse me, you know, like, where's the bathroom? They're like, behind you. And you're like, oh, <laughs> in the same room. Okay. <laughs> I hate dining rooms that are like that. And, um, like, <laughs> so <laughs> it's like, and the girl goes in this bathroom. So this is a commercial. The girl goes in the bathroom and she's like, oh no. And she's having like really bad gas and everything. And she's spraying like this aerosol spray. And she's all like, she's like spraying it all over. And pe and like she comes out and the smell of the air freshener comes out with her and like along with her other smells. And everybody's sitting there, they're like, what is the one? There's like two little kids. I think they're like a little boy and a little girl. And the little girl goes, ew, it, sm it smells like diaper gravy. <laughs> like, what the heck? Like people are going to sit there and say that to you. Like, if you have stomach problems and you come out of the bathroom, you know, like, at someone's house, they're not going to, well, I hope they don't say that to you, me, anybody, because that would be very embarrassing. But, <laughs> you know what, no, it wouldn't be embarrassing because everybody poops and everybody has diarrhea sometimes. So, <laughs> but, like, and then it goes through three different scenarios. So that was the first scenario. The second scenario is she's sitting there, she's all like, bing, bing, bing. She's like, oh my goodness, my cell phone. I forgot to turn it on silent. She's like, I gotta take this. I'll be right back. And then it shows her going in the bushes or something like that. And then the third one is like, she has poopery or whatever. And she goes in the bathroom and like sprays the, or in the toilet. And she's in the bathroom. And she's like, yes, I can fart now. Yes. And she's doing that and everything. And... <laughs> This commercial is like four minutes long, okay? I sat there for four minutes and I watched this. And, and the people outside in the dining room can hear her, obviously, because it's like a tiny little paper thin. Oh, I have a story for you. <laughs> okay, let me tell this one quick. Okay, so then she comes out, like she goes to the bathroom, she comes back out, and they're sitting there and they're all like, <clears throat> they're sitting there and they're all like um, at the table and they're like, they're like, oh my goodness, it smells like a lemon meringue pie. And then the kids are all like, it smells like candy. And one guy goes, you need to keep her. She's a keeper. She poops pies or something. And I'm like, oh gosh. It's like a really, like, that would not even be like a, like any kind of scenario. <laughs> So, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to stop this right now and I'm going to do a story time and I'm going to film it right now. So, <clears throat> oh, let me finish this. Let me finish this. This is like all the It's like all the garlic at the bottom. This story time that I have for you. <clears throat> it beats the one for my adult school experience where everybody heard me farting or like basically shitting. So that was so good. Mmm, that's very, very good. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What time is it? It's okay, it's 20 minutes. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope you guys have a great day and a wonderful evening, a wonderful morning whenever you're watching this. A wonderful midnight. But please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. And be well. Bye. Love you guys.